If you're following Johnny and Amber, it's been quite a while since Virginia ended. Now, there's two people in particular I want to talk about. Amber had two friends, one by the name of I.L. Tillett and one by the name of Rocky Pennington. Now, I mostly want to talk about I.L. today, but I'm going to mention Rocky as well. Now, here's the thing, and this is my main point. During the time when Amber was accusing Johnny and it wasn't legally resolved in Virginia, pretty much, especially towards the beginning, for Rocky, these two were on Amber's side. And Io was on Amber's side up until Io's appearance at Virginia. So I figured, you know what? What's up? Where are they now? And one of the things that triggered this was In the Fire, because this is Amber's first movie in a long time, and why aren't they supporting it? They can't just say, great job, Amber. You did great in the movie. Give it a good review. Wouldn't you expect that? Especially from Io, like I said, who's active on social media, and that's what I want to talk about. Here it is on Threads. This is from today when I'm making this video. Same name, Io loves you. Going towards 7,000 followers now. Last I checked, it was on like 5,500, so climbing up a little bit. If you don't know Threads, it's pretty much a lot like X, formerly Twitter. It's linked to Instagram and Facebook. I find it very bland. I don't enjoy it, but I check it out for news and things like that once in a while. And when I did, I found you know who on there. But not even on here is Io talking about Amber in the fire. No nothing. No poster. No congratulations. Why not? I thought Io was convinced that Amber was right. Io was convinced that Johnny did this stuff and we didn't know Johnny. You probably remember things Io said. Stuff like that. And in the early days, Io would fight with fans on social media. But now, not much. Io's talking about some cultural issues, things like that, stuff I'm not even going to touch here on this channel, but the point is, it's not about you-know-who. Talking about MySpace, well, that was a while ago. Just talking about things, you know, BS, whatever. So I actually asked Io a question. I say, hey, kind of off topic, but what do you think of the Dan Wooten allegations? After all, he has encouraged people to believe allegations before a court trial. And of course, I get no response. I check responses because Thread automatically shows you when you click responses who responded to you recently. And of course, nothing because I want to know what Io thinks of Dan Wooten. I mean, shouldn't Io be on the side of the people accusing Dan? On the side of Alex and Byline Times who are putting out all this information on Dan? That would make sense. And why can't I get a simple answer? Not like Io has like all these people, hundreds of comments. I think I was the only reply here, so I'm pretty sure Io must have seen it. Nothing. So the point is, Io's out there, active, but now, 100%, no mention of you know who, good luck in Aquaman 2, in the fire's fantastic, none of that. That's what you'd expect from a real friend. And if it's not a real friend, well... Not so trustable in the end. And now on to Rocky Pennington, which is a different story, but here's my silly little theory. I think in 2016, when this was written, they were buddy-buddy, Rocky was very close, getting supported by Amber in certain ways, big hookups, things like this. And in their imagination, they thought Amber might get this huge divorce settlement become a multi-millionaire, you know, whatever, double digits of millions, and then they'd move on as best friends. But it turns out Rocky disappeared, well, maybe because Amber lost. And now Amber is somewhat struggling. I mean, Amber's got some money left, obviously, but not enough to, like, give her friends all these huge hookups and penthouses and things. So that might be why Rocky did a little vanishing act. I googled her. These are all the hit results. And the thing is, this person, Rocky Pennington, who was a UFC fighter, comes up more than Amber's ex-friend, Rocky Pennington. There was even an article written about it. Interestingly, Raquel has been mixed up with another Raquel Pennington, 
who is the best friend of Hollywood actress Amber Heard. Moreover, both Raquel's also look identical to some and even have the same alias nickname of Rocky. In case you're wondering, yes, this has led to problems in the past, especially during Amber Heard's court trial. I wouldn't say look exactly alike, but yeah, pretty close. So when you search for Rocky now by Google, well, this person comes up just as much. Alongside headlines like this, Amber Heard's no longer friends, the real reason they're not friends, and things like that. You don't see headlines like, Rocky Pennington praises in the fire. Rocky Pennington's been on Amber's side all along. I.L. Tillett praises in the fire. I.L. Tillett praises in the fire. I.L. Tillett was right all along about the friendship with Amber. None of it. What happens now is we get a Houdini disappearing act. My theory, my opinion, because it didn't work out for Amber. If it had worked out, if she got like 50 million or her ridiculous 100 million countersuit, well, we might see these two in some pictures with Amber. Let me know what you think in the comments. Figure that update this right here. If you're not subscribed here, consider it. If you don't, I'll be sad, but I'll get over it. See you next time.